everyone, I'm Natalie Lucier and welcome to rawfoodswitch.com. In case you haven't noticed, it's winter here. And I wanted to discuss something that happens to a lot of raw foodists here. When it gets cold and it starts snowing like it does right now, we start reverting back to our old ways and we wonder why am I trying to eat so much raw food in the winter anyway, right? Because let's face it, this apple tree right behind me isn't going to be making any apples this winter. This summer it did, it was great, but right now it's hibernating. And although we would like as humans to hibernate during the winter, it's not possible. So instead, here we are, let's focus on some raw foods we can eat and why we want to be eating raw in the winter. If you want to be more environmentally friendly while still eating raw in the winter, you could pick up a lot of uh, fruits during the summer and freeze them and then thaw them out and eat them in the winter. This is what I did last summer. I picked a lot of blueberries, strawberries, and raspberries and froze them. And now we're still having some awesome smoothies right in the middle of winter. Food is our fuel. It gives us energy. And right now the sun isn't out here, but the food that we eat has been in the sun. It, but chances are you can't buy oranges like this one up north unless they're being shipped from Florida. This orange probably saw more sunshine in its entire life than most of us will see in one winter. So imagine eating this orange that has the energy of the sun. And imagine the energy of the sun going into you as you eat it. Wouldn't that be great? Wouldn't that fill you with your own energy of the sun? Of course, there's no scientific evidence in a lot of these things. And mainly it comes from my own intuition. But eating a sun-filled fruit gives you the energy of the sun itself and when you eat it you're getting the sunshine inside of you so say goodbye to common colds and other diseases that creep up during the winter what you're doing is you're eating live food in the dead of winter it's getting cold here so i'm going to wrap this up and let you know about some great raw food switch recipes later on so head over to rawfoodswitch.com for more recipes that you can make even in the middle of winter Enjoy!